wasn't married to an African, but okay. I've dated one. Ooh. And he was very of status. Ooh. Was he a president of some job? He was a famous soccer player. Ooh. He became the president of Liberia about eight years now ago. Now you know they finna Google. So what? He still acknowledged me. We're cool. His birthday was just a couple days ago. Happy birthday, boo. Ain't he married now? Who cares? <laughs> he was married then. She was somewhere else and, and I was being her. Tia Nacho was a mistress? Whatever you want to call it, honey. They were separated. She was not in the house with him. I was in his house. No, they do. There. They are allowed to have multiple wives yeah, and, and shit. Yeah, I didn't mind that. I was fresh out of, you know, <laughs> baby daddy drama. And honey, he, <laughs> he came and set my life free. That's who paid for the child support lawyer uh, for... <laughs> Wait, wait a minute. Girl, I won't sit here and lie to you, girl. So your Liberian president paid for your child support lawyer. He wasn't a president to, at the time. To, well, soccer player. Yes. To go after Will. Actually, Rick Ross. he paid for my, I caught a criminal case. Ross owed his daughter uh, a baby mom. You fought her? Yeah, she she came on to a uh, development where I stayed at, and I was mm -hmm. so happy to leave and go and pick up my two older sons from mm -hmm. school and saw her in the person and ran my truck into the car and got out and fought them and I was arrested on the property that I lived on because they say I left little Will in the car seat in the truck. That's that's, that's child neglect with no that's intent to harm normal and battery, in Florida, blah, blah, blah. But that's normal in Florida so, when you get out of the car to whip somebody's ass. Yeah, so I caught a What, I what you gonna take the baby case. out of the car while you fight? Exactly. But if unfortunately I caught a criminal case, I had three felonies and I was facing um, two years in prison because it was in Broward Kirk of Courts. But I was acquitted by a jury. Ross sent his mom, sister, and you know, to defend her on my trial. I had a seven day trial. And um, my African friend, the one paid for my attorney, we, we <clears throat> spent like almost $12,000 on oh, that attorney. Okay. So once that case was over with, when I won that trial, that attorney advised me to get a family attorney and put him on child support because she saw the support from his side coming to court to try to send me to prison because they had filed uh, cust primary mm. custody of my baby like twice doing that that criminal case. Who, who was going to raise the baby? Thank you. And his career had just went off. So I guess his mom thought that grandmothers had rights in the state of Florida. And you know no. that grandmothers don't have any rights the, in the state of no. Florida. Why don't sometimes Diddy is going to want to party and you got to tell him no. I'm reserving New Year's Eve to party with my winos in Houston, Texas. Get your glasses ready to bring in the new year with me at Bayou City Event Center December 31st. And after the show is the after party. Yeah. After the party is the uh-uh. We ain't doing none of that in Houston. Them numbers is too hot and too high right now. I can't wait to see y'all in Houston. Let the countdown begin for a night of wine, gossip, and comedy. Tickets on sale right now via TashaKOnStage.com. Now!